It's open. Come in. I'm glad I could get you on such short notice. Come in, come in. I'm glad I could bring you here because, well, consider it as extra credit of some sort. You see, I have to be get going somewhere for a mission. They need me over there. In short, I need you to take care of my house and also my, uh, my cats. Yes, my cats. I have two of them. One's name's Miffit. Uh, sorry. <clears throat> I kind of shook up about this mission a little bit. I don't know, really. They said it's going to be dangerous, so they're sending most of the pro heroes over there. No, it's not out of state or out of country. It's actually, um, it's relatively close around where I am right now. And sure, I want to make sure my house is safe and along with my cats. And since you're one of the best students as of right now, I trust you. All right, let me show you around. Right here is my living room, basically. There's the TV, the remote's always in the cup holders in the chair. Uh, over here is the kitchen, help yourself to any of the food that is in the fridge. I don't mind. Just don't touch the alcohol. <laughs> I would assume so that I know you're a third year and all, but just to make sure, don't touch the alcohol. Anyway, follow me. That's my room. Don't go in there. Um, that's a guest bedroom. You could sleep in there. And uh, bathroom is down the hall right there. You can order food here. I don't mind. Just make sure you take care of your stuff. And right there, that's my cat, Mittens. Mm -hmm. She's a real friendly gal. So, just pet her a few times and she'll be alright. Make sure to feed them, yada yada yada. I don't know where my other cat's scarf is. He usually is the rambunctious one. He gets zoomies all the time. He likes to run around the house. Especially going out of my room into the bathroom, back into the living room, and then repeating that process over and over again until he tires out. If you really want to see them have fun, I have some catnip in the cabinet up there. They don't know what's there. so, And, um... I think I also have a laser pointer somewhere I don't remember where I put it it might be on the coffee table out in the living room but yeah that's basically all of it you have any questions concerns no like I said if you want to make something, just make sure you clean up the stuff afterwards. I don't want my house to be a mess after I'm gone. I have two bedrooms because I could afford it. And sometimes, well, not that long ago, I kind of had a roommate. We were kind of sharing the rent, but now that I could afford it, he moved out to his own place. Who was my roommate? Oh, President Mike. President Mike was my roommate for a little bit. Of course. Me and Mike are always been together ever since our first year as a UA. We're kind of close friends. And even though he can be loud and obnoxious, I still consider him my friend. 
Mm hmm. Come on, Mittens. Don't be like that. You know I'll be right back. <laughs> I swear to God, every time I talk to these cats, I feel like they would talk back to me. Like they're actually listening and having a conversation with me. Oh, well. To be honest with you, I'm not very much a dog person. President Mike is. President Mike. I keep calling him President Mike as a joke. And no, I can't stop calling him that. <laughs> as I was saying, President Mike is the dog person. I'm the cat person. You see, they have a dog as well. I think it was either a pug or a golden retriever. It's been so long since I've been to his place. But yeah, he has a dog. He's a dog people. I am the cat people. <sighs> no, I'm not a crazy cat guy. Not just yet. Although my students are driving me to the brink of insanity. <laughs> I'm only pulling your leg. Now listen. Like I said before, my house is close to where this investigation is going on. I'm going to be gone for a few days because of stakeout. I trust you that nothing is going to happen to my cats or my home, right? Good. That's what I like to hear. So, in the meantime, help yourself to drinks and whatnot. Um, I'm pretty sure that some Japanese cartoons are on around like, I don't know, 11 at night or something like that. You seem like you'd be the type of person to like those Japanese cartoons. Mm hmm. Um, I don't know. Last one I remember watching was it's called Two Piece. Yeah, I don't know something about some pirate eating like a rare meat or something like that, and they gained powers. Yeah, it's weird. These uh random people eat these weird meats, and they get powers off of it. It's complicated. It's been going on for like years now, so there's like over a thousand episodes. Mm -hmm. So if you're into that, it comes on around like 11 or whatnot. There's a lot of them. But besides that, please make sure to take care of my cats. <laughs> I don't want anything to happen to them. Don't worry, Mittens. I'll be back. I'll be back in like three days. All right. I trust you. Hmm? Ah, yes, about that. We haven't identified every single suspect about that whole attack on the UA building. Um, we only know Overhaul and some green-haired person. That's all we know so far. But... We know where Overhaul's outpost is, or his new one. It's in an abandoned building, and, well, that's... We're going to be heading out to the outskirts of that building, so we can have surveillance look around. That's why I'm there, to help out with surveillance. We're going to be staying in a hotel, not nearby. Well, not nearby, as in relatively close. Mm hmm. All right. Well, you have fun in my home now. I have to get going myself because I'm already late enough as it is to the stakeout. It is late at night. All right. You take care now. And make sure you feed my cats. See you later. <laughs> <laughs> 